and uh, of course welcome to Supercars of London and here we go on a bright and sunny Friday. Firstly, I'm apologising for not uploading a video yesterday. I said on Monday that I was going to be doing daily videos and unfortunately yesterday um, when I headed over to Yanni at Yanni Mai's, uh, one I didn't record it and film it or vlog it and two I had planned on doing my Geneva uh, supercar update and opinions video However, I ran out of time. I got back at about six o'clock, and then if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that then I went out to play uh, the Top Golf with a couple of guys from SB Race Engineering, and I absolutely wiped the floor with them. Today, I am making up for the loss of one video yesterday by making an array of videos. I'm hoping to make between four and five videos today as I'm driving around the M25 towards Essex, home of Towie, home of the fake tan, and um, I'm really looking forward to driving my car there and showing it off. I'm heading to Gad Tuning today who are ECU remapping specialists and uh, they're going to be doing some fancy stuff with my engine which I'll explain in a bit. We're going to go into loads of detail on a separate video in itself. This is just a vlog of what is happening today as I drive over the M25, anything happens along the way or whatever, just a standard vlog um, and I'll get to show you around some of the, what the cars uh, GAD tuning are working on at the moment. I have no idea what's going to be there, whether there's going to be anything special or fancy there or whatever uh, but I'm really looking for, forward to going today because they're going to be transforming my car and the engine and the way that it runs which I'm really really um, excited about because over the last 12 months or 11 months now nearly 12 months I've been driving this car and I've become very very used to it and when I met up with them a couple of weeks ago uh, in, in a Starbucks they were telling me loads and loads of little tricks of the trade that you can do with the FSI Audi engine that um, are really going to help enhance the performance of the car but also the efficiency of the fuel. So those two things really excite me, especially as I'm going to be driving down to Monaco very soon within the next month and a half or so for the Top Marks event. So uh, that's going to be a really exciting uh, trip. But also GAD Tuning are going to be challenging me to a drive down to Monaco. They're not, it's not a race or anything like that. It's more of a fuel efficient race or a test or a challenge or whatever it is. Like I did London to Edinburgh for the Gumball 3000. This is gonna be slightly different and slightly longer. So um, head over to GAD now. And uh, yeah, I'll introduce you to everyone there when I arrive. So ladies and gentlemen, this is a quick update on the vlog. I've just filmed the whole entire journey on the M25 talking about my opinions of the Geneva Motor Show and I hope to upload that video this Sunday at midday for you guys to watch and check out my opinions on some of the supercars that got launched the Geneva. I felt like the video went quite well and I was quite good on camera in terms of talking about my opinions and using um, correct terminology. There's also going to be another car that you may recognise, you may not recognise. I can't remember whether I did a video on it or not. However, it is an Audi R8, it is a V8, and it does have Army Trix exhaust. There's going to be two Audi R8s at the GAD tuning that both have Army Trix exhaust. So, um, yeah, today is uh, going to be fun, and I've just seen a sign for McDonald's. It's just got better. What's up, guys? Now I'm down at GAD tuning where my car is in there. There you go. I oh, know you got my cap. <laughs> um, and what they're going to be doing now is they're going to be taking readings of all of the uh, ECU to do with the car so that they know how it's running at the moment so that they can um, then work out the best possible, most efficient um, new power delivery on the car. And um, then we'll be waiting for the guys that are going to decoke my <coughs> engine. Basically, in the Audi FSI engines, the V8s, the big ones, they are very prone to carbon buildup all around the car, in the manifolds, the exhaust system, and in the engine as well, pistons, everything. And what decoking does basically is eradicates all of that, so every single bit of the engine feels brand new. It's just got better. I'm really looking forward to uh, finding out how much better the car is um, in terms of throttle response, power delivery, and torque as well. So this day is really exciting because I feel that my car is going to be transformed into something um, that I haven't experienced yet since owning the car. And then the Living With A Supercar one year anniversary update is going to be a very exciting one as I'll re-review -re the car along with other stuff. And um, I'm standing by potentially my second supercar. Not the spider though. Yeah, we can do. We can 
challenge the uh, London to Monaco challenge on YouTube so you guys can uh, look forward to that which uh, I'm quite scared about to be honest and I'm just cruising back now to SB Race Engineering when I'm going to get this video edited for you uh, to watch tonight or now because you'll be watching it now oh. and yeah great day I hope you guys have uh, enjoyed the supercars that were there at GAD tuning from the R8s, the Lamborghinis and things like that. And now it's just a long drive home on the M25, but I've had good runs on the M25. It hasn't been a car park today, which is always good news. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you've enjoyed and stay tuned for the detailed video on what's to come on what my car read before with the hydrocarbons, all of the unburned fuel in my car, and then how they cleaned it out. Because that video is coming soon. It's a really, really interesting video, along with the before and after of what this car is like. And my reaction of driving this car for the first time since having the, uh, the GAD magic sprinkled all over my car. So thanks, guys. Make sure you subscribe to Supercars of London if you don't already. I almost forgot my YouTube channel there. And like the video if you like it, and comment below. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. BMW i8, a white one on the other side of the road. Nice. Great way to end the video. See you later. Take care, guys.